Okay, Hunter. I'm Abe. I got volunteered to show you the ropes. We're stuck in this metal box for about 30 seconds while the monster gets a head start. So, let's talk about monster hunting. The thing you gotta keep in mind is, this ain't about just running around and shooting bad guys like you're some kind of goddamn Navy SEAL or whatever. You were hunting a monster on an alien planet. And that ain't like anything else. You already know how to use a gun and run around and how to face which direction and all that bullshit. You're not an idiot. We're gonna teach you monster hunting. It may seem... I mean, it's a lot to deal with, but after only like three or five matches, you'll get it. You see those glowing blue tracks in front of you? That means that asshole was just here. Keep on his trail, and hope he doesn't grow too much by the time we find him. Alright, now just stick to those tracks. The other half of the team will catch the monster if it starts veering off in some crazy direction. If both halves work together, you'll corner the monster and one of you can land a dome, Getting close. When you find him, though, he's gonna bolt. That's what the mobile arena's for. It traps a monster, forces a fight. It'll let you know when you're in range. Then, you just hold the button down and the monster is trapped in a giant dome with you and your team. Okay, here we go. You're right on top of him. But he's gonna try to bolt. When you see... Now! Throw the dome! You got him! Fuck yeah! Pro Hunter! I knew you could do it! about reloading. There ain't no ammo to pick up or anything like that. It's the future. You don't need that shit. If you got some gear that takes a long time to reload or recharge or whatever, go ahead and stow it. It'll recharge in the background. Watch your HUD so you can see when it's ready. The good news is you poked through a shitload of damage to the monster. Bad news is the dome is down and it can run away. Then it breaks. Okay, the dome is down, so the monster's gonna run, and there ain't a damn thing you can do about it. I know, you're thinking, dome it again. Well, you can't. We got all kinds of science fiction shit, but it all runs on batteries, and batteries gotta recharge. Ain't no such thing as a free lunch. All we can do now is keep tabs on the monster till it's had a chance to charge back up again. Good thing is, it gives us time to hone those tracking skills and maybe learn something new. You can follow his tracks while the other half of your crew goes to cut him off. Or you can let your buddies follow the tracks and you can try to cut the monster off. Well, I teach you the advanced shit. Alright, now just stick to those tracks. Hear that? That's the monster letting us know he's stage two. It means he's bigger and stronger. He likes roaring about it, makes him feel threatening, trying to scare us. Let's find him before he hits stage three, because that is bad news. You're gonna hear your teammates say, he's headed west. And you're like, what the fuck, which way is west? Well, you got a compass down there. Anytime you need to tell someone which way to go, just look at your compass. Okay, so you can't find the monster. Here's your chance to shine. Dome that fucker. The dome only lasts you guys are the monsters taking up of a beating. Apparently, the damn thing doesn't know the difference between good guys and bad guys. You get close to the monster, you throw that thing out there, and it traps the monster in with you. The dome stays up until either the monster downs a hunter. The team does a ton of damage to the monster. Yeah, you probably recognize that guy. That's Griffin Halsey. Man down! You got a teammate on their ass and bleeding out. Get over there and pick him up fast, or the whole team's screwed. Here come the reinforcements. This is the first time the ship comes back pretty fast. Next time, it'll take longer. This is what I was talking about earlier. Teammates start to go down, next thing you know, the dome drops too. 
On the upside, the monster usually hightails it out of there when that happens. Gives you a chance to pick up casualties and regroup. Anytime you want to point something out to your teammates, ping it. Yellow ping means just look over there. Orange ping means wildlife, probably dangerous. Red ping means that's where the monster is. Get your ass in gear. Just don't ping all the time like an asshole. Come on.